Hey, hey, my beautiful treasures. Welcome back to my channel. Today I have a beautiful anti-inflammatory cleansing and nice healing juice slash smoothie for you. I got my gloves ready. I got my fruit slash veggies ready. So what you're going to need is a pineapple, a green apple, or multiple. The amount, you do not have to copy the amount. You have to calculate how many people you make the juice for and then calculate the amount of the produce you need. For me, it's my partner and me and we are basically two people. I'm probably going to use only half of the pineapple ananas because I'd rather make a fresh one tomorrow, for example. So you have to calculate your own amount. You need ginger. Most important are Turmeric, it's always best if you get it fresh. Turmeric, curcuma, it's amazing. Ginger. Also, when you're searching for ginger, do not buy the big bulbs, the big ginger. It should be the small one. And when you cut it up, it has this beautiful, nice radiant. Do you see how radiant that is? It can be even more radiant. It's a little bit dry. <laughs> nice yellow. And you smell it. I can smell it from here. It's a nice, strong smell. This is ginger that actually will benefit your health. Not that genetically modified, excuse me, stuff. <laughs> lime. Uh, this is not key lime. That's the best I can get here where I live. So this is what it is. A cucumber and some celery. Those are amazing to cleanse and heal your body. Get rid of all of that mucus now. First and foremost, the most important thing, dear treasures, I do highly recommend this juice for the Canada diet, especially because of the ginger that is anti-yeast, not only antibacterial, and the curcuma. It's great for literally everything in your body. The celery, of course, as well, the limes. But I highly do not recommend making this juice when you are at the beginning stages of your Canada diet because, as we know, Candida yeast lives off sugar, and it's not discriminating between processed or natural sugar. And pineapple, the ananas, has a good amount of sugar. So definitely make this juice when you already see bettering with your eczema, psoriasis, whatever you have, your sinuses. When you already are healing, basically I would recommend this juice only after like 2-3 months, depending on your personal journey because it's just too sweet. So it will feed your yeast and you will have issues again. I was eating uh, green apples. It still has some sugar, but less than a pineapple. But generally on, in the first months of my Canada diet, I was only eating berries like strawberries and raspberries because they have uh, the least amount of sugar, even though they still have some. So also in moderation, of course, not every day. Blueberries, and they also have a high amount of uh, water, many berries, like for example, strawberries. And I started eating green apples a few times the week, I think in the second month of my diet. But I'm going to talk about my personal Canada journey in a few weeks or months. Just highly do not recommend you to make this in the beginning of your diet because that's just double the work for you because you will make it worse for your stomach to heal the yeast. So you will give it more work and you will take longer to heal. So let's chop it all up. I have a nice mixer, a blender I'm going to use. If you want to pick the best pineapple, I recommend to take it here and then you just try to take it out. And if it comes out easily, that pineapple is nice and ripe. So you can take that. Another trick I use when you're searching for a nice ripe avocado, Take this out, the pit, right? And if it's nice green like here, that's the perfect avocado that we are searching for and we want. And of course it will be moldy or grayish, whitish, if it's well moldy and too ripe. This is a trick I use since many years to get the perfect avocado. And this is how I chop my pineapple. Now those could also be used to make a nice juice, maybe in summer, nice refreshing drink. 
could boil it a little bit or just let it steep in a warm or cold water and put some ice cubes in there, some mint. I think that would be amazing. We got the stem, so cut it like that. And I think I'll use the half of the pineapple and I'll keep this half for another day. Don't you just love fruit? Amazing. Now I'm going to cut something softer so it's easier for the mixer. I think I'll use half of the cucumber. I'll cut this a little bit, why not? It's supposed to be an organic cucumber so I washed it and I'm not going to peel it. And the mixer we go. This is going to clear up all of the sinuses because <laughs> there's a lot of ginger and turmeric. You need a little amount, by the way, if you're not experienced with ginger, uh, with turmeric. A little amount goes a long way. <laughs> Look at that. Look at the goodness. I'll show you. Ooh, now this, this is beautiful. Look at that. Also, if you didn't know, now you know, the stains from this, very hard to wash out. So be careful. Do not wear white clothes <laughs> or light colored clothes, clothing. Look at that. This is the ginger and the curcuma you want to go for. Now let's get our apple. Do you prefer green apples or red apples by the way? Now the last thing we have to chop is our celery. It's a little bit old but it will do just fine. Lastly some lime juice make like this before you are going to cut your citrus. We're going to add a secret ingredient as well, which is a pinch of Celtic salt. Celtic salt has amazing benefits for your health. Put a little bit in my water every time to hydrate my body. This is what I use for straining, hold a knot bag. It's very, very fine and it's even better than a cheesecloth for me personally. By the way, in Europe we have these type of cloths, kitchen cloths. They are washable with 60 degrees, with 90 degrees. It stays alive through high degrees in a washing machine and it's reusable. It's awesome. And you can buy it in like multi-packs for um, one euro. So that's cool. It's good. Definitely the celery is coming through. You can taste it, but it's tiny amount and uh, it actually really tastes good. So I think you would enjoy it, beautiful treasures. <laughs> Let me know if you make it, if you like it and if it helps you. And if you would like to see more of such health content. And for now, I wish you a beautiful day slash evening. And I'll see you in my next video. Cheers to all of our health, beautiful treasures. Thank you for being here on this journey with me. And keep going. We got this. Cheers.